I don't believe you, Gabrielle. I can't believe you're actually trying to lie about this. I'm not lying about anything, Gabrielle. Rubber ducky, rubber ducky, Alpha Bravo. My name is Jack, and I actually almost just wiped out, guys. Welcome back to the YouTube channel of pure awesomeness and glory, guys. It's dark in my room, and I'm in front of my computer monitor because I have no life, and I spend way too much time in here. But that doesn't matter because your boy got the new merch art. Okay, if you haven't joined the Jack and Gab fam, the rubber ducking army, guys, I don't know what you're doing. Okay, this is the new merch of 2020. Okay, and the one that you're getting is even better than this one because it's actually touched up a little bit. Oh my, but guys, let's be honest with each other right now. Let's just be honest. You know, let's have a little bit of honesty. Okay, this is honesty hour. Let's talk about this. Let's Let's talk about the fact that we got the best merch in the game, and I know you've heard that a hundred times. You know, everybody's always best merch, you know, Jake Potter's low gang. No, listen, okay, listen. It's the rubber duck and army. This literally looks like something you'd find at Paxon. You see your friend wearing it, and you wouldn't even think anything of it. And that was the whole point. If you guys are interested in the new 2020 rubber duck and merch, it's only available for a short period of time, and it'll be hyperlinked down below. We really appreciate your support, especially Gabrielle, because she designed it. So before we begin, though, this video is actually sponsored by Choices. Now, this is a free-to-play game on the phone, and the coolest part, you guys probably know, I'm sure a lot of you guys play iPhone games, it's very rare to find a game that actually has you in control. You you actually feel like your choices matter and this is one of those games where your choices actually matter choices is basically a free-to-play game on your phone that has many different stories that you can take part in and go whichever direction you want you basically you choose a story to, to do to play and then you your options dictate the story what you choose to do in the story dictates what happens in the story so it's kind of like an interactive storybook game that's free on your phone that you can play whenever you want so it's basically a free-to-play game on your phone that has multiple different games aka stories that you could select and then control so in other words, there's literally no reason not to download it. The writing and the art in the game is absolutely incredible. It's really good. I'm not trying to be corny or anything, but it actually is really, really good, especially for an iPhone game, like a game on your phone. I also know a lot of girls and some guys are playing and there's a whole lot of customization, okay? You can change your outfits, you can change how your character looks, make it look like you anything you want to do. So if you guys are interested in choices, it'll be linked at the top of the description down below. Like I said, it's free to play. It's a lot of fun. Give it a try. As you guys can see, there's just, there's so many different stories you can choose from. And there's also, I also just want to mention that there's so many different genres, but we're going to go to romantic drama and we're going to go to ride or die because I've been told that this one is pretty good. So Logan isn't the type of boy you can bring home to dad, dot, dot, dot. Oh my God. Oh, this is hot. This is real hot. Tap to continue. Chapter one, the boy with the car. You're sitting shotgun in a sleek sports car. The streets of Los Angeles blur past. Over the roar of the engine, you hear your heart pounding in your chest. You glance in the side view mirror at the top cars right on your trail. I wanna be the prettiest girl that I can possibly be, and this girl right here is honestly my type, so kinda looks like Gabrielle, no lie. So like I was saying, you can choose your dialogue. I barely even recognize myself. A voice calls your name. My name is Daddy. Probably not the most appealing or realistic name, but you know what? It's our story, and I can do whatever I want. What's your last name? Daddy Duck. You know, I like to stay true to character. Name yourself Daddy Duck? Confirm, baby. Come on now. Come on now. You turn to the car's driver, his piercing eyes locked with yours. Oh! He's so hot! Is this the driver? I'll choose that guy. I'm gonna have to do something a little risky. Do you trust me? I'm gonna leave it at that, ladies and gentlemen. You've gotta figure out what happens next. Click the link at the top of the description down below to check out Choices. Once again, Choices, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Click it at the top of the description. It's completely free. I think you guys have a lot of fun, but in the meantime, let's get back to this prank. I have something to talk about, guys. So, you guys have seen, there's this there's this trend. We tend to ride the waves, the trends, and it's, it's a video title where you basically, the girl leaves a positive pregnancy test just out for their boyfriend to find. Well, guys, I, you know, I, I could sit here with my thumb up my keister, just rubber ducking, waiting, for that day to come, where Gabrielle decides, you know, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna go get a pregnancy test. I'm gonna get the little marker and I'm gonna do a little me 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 me. Okay, two lines, and then you put it in the counter, and you know, I, I could react to it and everything, and think I had a kid, or I could be a proactive rubber ducking daddy and get it done, rubber duckers. And by that, I mean. <laughs> 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 
god! <laughs> Y'all thought, look at what I did. Or, I shouldn't say I did, I had someone do for me because I didn't know what this was supposed to look like. So what I'm going to do is basically I'm gonna put this in my bathroom and then I'm gonna have Gabrielle react to it being in my bathroom because she's gonna be wondering who the hell left a positive pregnancy test in my rubber duck and daddy's bathroom. Guys, I, when Gabrielle comes over here, it's for two things, my penis or to play Nintendo games. Okay, she ain't coming over here to have a kid. <laughs> Pretty self-explanatory, guys. I'm just gonna put that right there. I'm gonna have Gabrielle go to the bathroom, or at least wait for her to eventually go to the bathroom. That's what's gonna suck. I'm gonna have to have the camera just sitting for a very long time, just because I'm gonna have to wait for her to eventually come in here. But I've cleaned up my bathroom for once in my life, even the toilet. And um, I basically just wanted to make it as hard for her to not notice, because it's gonna be pretty hard to not notice, you know. So, <laughs> but I hope you guys are excited and also if you want me to do a video like this again, can we get a like? Okay, I'm literally putting my relationship on the line and like as easy as I make that seem, it's not. I just, I found something at Jack's apartment in his bathroom, and I'm on it. No, I'm not being crazy. I literally found a pregnancy test. Yes, it's a real one. I know what a pregnancy test looks like. Too, but it's not mine. 
Well, duh, I don't think you would do that. But there's literally a positive pregnancy test and I'm looking at it right now. I don't want to just ask him out of the blue. Should I just wait? Or should I like start talking about something like about it? Yes, I'm just pissed and I want to figure out like who the heck is, whose is it? Well, I don't think he, it, no, it wouldn't be his roommate's girlfriend's. Why would it be in Jack's bedroom? That literally makes no sense whatsoever. Well, duh. Well, I don't want to ask him right now. I literally just said that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm being rude. I'm just pissed. You're my sister. I just wanted to tell you. I am not making this up. I'm looking at it right now. I will send you a picture if you don't believe me. No, this isn't a prank. I'm calling my sister for help. Oh my gosh, I'm sending you a picture of it. Did you get it? Well, wait a second. It takes a second for it to send. I told you. I'm pissed. I just don't get why it's there. And I don't know why he wouldn't have told me if anything was happening. And I just don't know why it would just be here. Like, I don't know whose it would be. Like, I want to think the best and think maybe it is his roommate's girlfriend's or something. Well, he's in the living room right now. No, he can't hear me. It's literally two shut doors in completely different areas. You're making all this noise. Getting ready, like I said. Okay. Just leave me alone. Okay. Um, Will and Emily are here, so don't like. Cause you seem in a shitty mood, so if you're in a shitty mood, don't be like. You know what I'm saying? Seriously? So I think it's safe to say that we got her, um, but fortunately while I was sitting out in the living room while Gabrielle was upset about a positive pregnancy test, I told both Will and his girlfriend to leave or if you want to stay, just know that Gabrielle's about to run out here and be very upset because she thinks I'm cheating on her or she's confused or something. So fortunately, both my sweet mate and his girlfriend were in on it, but I wanted to film her coming out and I only had one camera rolling. So I had to improvise and use my iPhone, but nah, I think I think it worked either way. Tell me right now, whose is this? <laughs> What? I don't know. You don't know? No. It was in your bathroom. I don't want any fucking lies. I don't want but I want an answer. I don't know stop. who this is. Just stop lying. Tell me. I don't know. it's really pissing me off that you didn't say anything to me about this and that was in your freaking bathroom. I went through literally all your stuff. Whose is it? Did you ask Emily? No. That seems like the appropriate thing to do. It was in your bathroom. Tell me. Maybe they put it in there as a joke. Stop. Why is there a positive Stop. pregnancy test Stop in my bathroom? Lying. I don't know why there's a positive pregnancy test in my bathroom. Oh my is God. this a prank? Oh is this God. the positive pregnancy Stop. prank? Stop. 
I've seen this before on YouTube. This is the yeah, so this is the positive but pregnancy usually prank. It's the girlfriend, stop lying. This is a prank. Stop. I don't believe you for one second. Where's the camera? Jack, stop. Stop. This is not funny. This is I don't not believe a joke. You. It was in your bathroom. Stop lying. I don't believe you, Gabrielle. I can't believe you're actually trying to lie about this. I'm not lying about anything, Gabrielle. I'm not lying about anything. You didn't even ask the other girl that was here. Granted, she's gone now. Probably because you were making a ruckus in there. Just tell me. I don't know whose that is. This is a prank. You're pranking me. I don't believe that that was in my bathroom. It's positive, too. Do you think that was a way of them telling... Are we being pranked? Are they here? Shut Will! Stop. No, stop. because I literally heard stop. him. I was with him five minutes ago, and now he's gone. Will! He actually is gone. Is this for real? Are you being serious? Stop lying. This is... This is... Tell me the truth right now. I don't care if it was Will's girlfriend, but you have to be honest with me because it was in your bathroom. There's no freaking way that someone can't get into your bedroom when there's literally a code on the door. And Will knows my code. Closed. Will knows my code. Yeah, really? Then why wouldn't his own girlfriend? Sweetheart, we're being pranked. This is Stop. a prank. Stop. It's not a prank. You are pranking me right now, Kevin. I'm calling you out. This is not are real. I don't Stop. believe. Just shut up for a minute. Just shut up. Think about it. What you're saying makes zero sense. If Will's girlfriend wanted to use her bathroom, how would she get it into your bathroom? She doesn't know. Because of Will. Will does. But then if Will knows your code, why would he let his own girlfriend into your bathroom to take pregnancy tests? To test? put the pregnancy test in there. We're being pranked. You're hey, in on this. Stop. Are you stop. being serious? Yes, I'm being serious. I don't know what the issue is, sweetheart. You don't know what the issue is. I don't know. I don't understand why you be would believe that I would put a positive pregnancy test open like that for you to see. That would be stupid. Stop lying. Are you saying that I've cheated on you? Well, I don't know what happened. I don't know whose pregnancy test that is. I, I don't, I'm just shocked that you wouldn't just immediately assume that it was someone else's. You literally think I cheated on you. I don't think you cheated on me. I just don't get why there's a positive pregnancy test in there. Because of Will and Emily and you're pranking me. No, it's a I, prank. I've seen this before. I thought that too, but no. It's not. Like, why would I get it if, if you were being nice and letting Emily use your bathroom or John's girlfriend using your bathroom? Like, that's okay. Just tell me. Because it's not funny. That okay, fine. Things. They use my bathroom and they put their pregnancy test in there. Wow, that was really convincing, Jack. Well, Gabra, I don't know what you want me to say because I definitely didn't have sex with another girl, get her pregnant. And I know, and I, I know. I, let's I be know, honest. If I was going to do that, I would not be an idiot Can't and put the out. test. I know, I know. In, yeah, so that's, yeah, this is a prank. You're pranking me. Stop. It's not funny. Jack, stop. It's not. Yes, it is. Just tell me. Come here. Stop. Truce. This is a prank. I don't believe this for one second. Sit. I'm trying to talk to you. I'm not attacking you. Stop getting in defense mode like you always Gabriel, do. Gabriel, bottom line is I don't know whose it is. So. It was in your bathroom though. I have no idea whose it is. It I don't was know. in your bathroom. I, it's Jack, not mine. You need to I'm, stop lying. Just tell me. I don't care. You're lying. Someone you're else pranking me. Your I'm not bathroom. stupid. Hi you YouTube. Oh. Hi YouTube. Hi you YouTube. Anything serious? No, obviously not. Oh my God. I f up, not only for filming hot dog style, but also for pranking my girlfriend like this. Or I also just realized that the camera in the bathroom is still rolling. Oh my God. Gabrielle. What is the matter? God, I look good in this hoodie. It was literally like I know this right is a prank. Here. I know this is a prank. So I'm a so, Stop. What's up, YouTube? Merch in description. Out here. Hold on. Workout Jack, routine diet guide coming soon. My phone is not recording. Camera, babe. Where's the camera? I don't know. There's no camera in here.
Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my gosh. What? Where's the pregnancy test? In your living room. Just tell me whose it is. Whose is it? What? Whose is it? It's no one's, Gabrielle. Well, oh my it god. got in your bathroom somehow. It doesn't just grow legs. Just stop lying. I know you didn't cheat on me. You don't have... You wouldn't do it. What? You wouldn't cheat on me. Just tell me whose it is. Just tell me where the camera is, babe. Oh my god. I want to punch you. Come in here and tell me where the camera is. You thought Come in here. In there. It smells good. Come in here. No. It smells like beef jerky and Gatorade. Get in here. After about 15 solid minutes of trying to convince the woman of my dreams, the girl I love and the girl I just so happened to be pranking today, she finally, finally waited until my fart dissipated and then she finally came into the bathroom and I got to tell her that it was a prank. So, um, yeah. Come on. Come hither. Hither, hither, hither. Where's the camera? There is no... Camera. All right, I'm leaving town. Are you kidding me? I told you that was a prank. I knew you were pranking me. Stop. That it's over. Stop. Stop. You telling me that that camera just appeared there? Judge I know you're not. <laughs> no more. You dinner. You owe me. Gabrielle, you cannot get that mad at me, and you came out there, but, oh my god, please, no suffocation. Gabrielle, you hate me. The way you came out of my room in the living room, for one, why'd you make me wait like 30 minutes for that? I thought you'd I see it. I talked to my sister on the phone. You talked to Madeline? I don't know if she told my mom yet. Oh my god, call your sister and tell her. I didn't think you'd do that. She's definitely told your mom. I was freaking out, I was pissed. Guys, surprising as surprising as this is, it seems as though pranks have repercussions. No, 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 Please tell me, no. Stop talking. I'm trying to tell you something. Who, did you tell anyone about this? She told Cassie. Tell her to tell Cassie it was fake. Tell, okay, slow down, slow down. Uh, yes, okay, no, listen. What? I don't know why she- Jack did. was filming this. I, why are we not- Don't be mad at me, just tell Cassie it was fake. Why are we not putting it on speaker? It's fake. I know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, no, I didn't know. You yell at Jack that I'm not I'm not listening to this. You call him, be Wait, mad, hold on. whatever. Bye. <laughs> she could have told my mom. She could have, that would have been awesome. Oh Anyways, guys, gosh. hope you enjoyed that video. Merch is available down below. Why aren't you wearing merch, Gabrielle? Don't don't you know that we're gonna do a pregnancy prank? Get I mean, out, get This out. video literally has prank and pregnancy in it. This video is gonna get a million views. I'd like for you to be wearing merch. Anyways, guys, we hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you in the next one. Oh, it smells.